Welcome, young Skywalker. I have been expecting you. You no longer need those. Guards, leave us. <clears throat> I'm looking forward to completing your training. In time, you will call me Master. Hello there, only one Kenobi here, only one. This is the last to review now, and then we can get the giveaway underway. This is Emperor Palpatine. I'm not gonna lie to you, this guy is a bit of a favorite now because in my giveaway video, and if you do wanna win this, you can comment on my 2000 subscriber giveaway video because I have five figures to offer you. You could win Emperor, you could win alternative card back Luke, you could win alternative card back Boba Fett from Return of the Jedi. Awesome Krennic, something that is just absolutely ridiculous. We should have that in the vintage collection by now. They're holding back on that one or something or forgotten him or what, I don't know. And for the Empire Strikes Back, of course, be rude not to have this awesome Wedge Antilles card back. If you want to see reviews of them, they are already up. But these are customs that were made by Tatooine Customs, an amazing customizer who does his card backs in the style of the modern vintage collection, as opposed to say doing it in an 80s style. Because these are, of course, 80s card backs. But look at, oh, excuse me. I've got to do something about that. When I move that on this wooden surface, it makes that noise, it's horrible. So there it is. He does it in a great kind of style. He has it kind of like an unpunched thing going on there. And then inside the tray, he goes for accessory, what do you call them? Compartments almost, just like the Vintage Collection TVC. And then the security thing there. So he does a great job. It's really hard to film this, this card back because he's very black. And then I'm obviously filming in natural light just for this video, if you don't mind. Natural light sometimes really does show something off clearer. Clear, not more clear, Lord Vader. So, and the figure that I have repacked or recarded is this figure here. He's just got his back to us now, but he'll, he'll turn around. This is an awesome Emperor figure. The 5 POA one, 100% solid goods. My hope or my desire my desire is that Hasbro can, yeah, they can't not recycle that face. They nailed it, look at this. But they should get that on a combination of hard and soft goods, just like a figure over here. This is my prequel shelf. Let's go for a little ride, ladies and gentlemen. Over here, we've got this figure, which I love very much. A lot of people have got their issues with this. Well, fair play, you know. You know, if that's their opinion, fine. But if I could just focus on him. There he is. The figure is the, um, well, Darth Sidious from The Phantom Menace, but it's a, I love the combination of soft and hard goods because you can't do any better than that in terms of sculpting that hood, which is so iconic. You can't do that with soft goods, so you need hard goods. And I think the blend is, is nice enough. It might show up on the camera because this is an, an HD camera. You might see the difference, but I'll tell you what, it does look good. If I do it like this and you see the silhouette, look at that. You can't knock that. That is... Sidious, I'm sending my apprentice, Darth Maul, to join you. Whatever he says, you know what I mean? Awesome. So I think they could do that with this fella. They could do it again. Uh, even if they kitbashed it somehow, but uh, I certainly don't want to see a 5 POA figure inside a vintage card. It's got to be something awesome. It's got to be the definitive figure on beautiful card back. That's what the vintage collection is all about. But anyway, fantastic. Great car bike, really need it, so do something about it, Hasbro. Share this video, you know, let's spread the word or whatever. Hit a thumbs up, that helps. You know, it's just one of those things, it's so obvious, why haven't they done it already? Maybe I'm just not being patient enough, maybe on the 40th anniversary of the Return of the Jedi, we will get it. However, we've had absolutely cool this year for the 40th anniversary of The Empire Strikes Back. I mean, one could argue there's not that many characters, or not as many characters in the Empire Strikes Back. But you know what? Damn it, there's a hell of a lot that they could have done. Over there, you'll see my Empire shelf there. I've got Ugnaughts, I've got Lando Calrissians up there. I've got, uh, you know, there's a Lobot that they could have done, but you know, it's just a bummer, man, isn't it? But still, there's always hope that they will do this one. But if you can't wait for them to do it themselves, you've got a chance to win it via my channel. So just comment on that video that you would like to win it and you could be the lucky winner and win this figure card back. 
in the giveaway. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Again, it's quite difficult to film this. It just sort of glares a bit, that car, but it's still awesome. This has been Only One Kenobi. Only one. Out. You're gravely mistaken. You will not convert me as you did my father. Oh, no. My young Jedi. I think you'll find it is you who are mistaken about a great many things. His lightsaber. Ah, yes. A Jedi's weapon. Much like your father's. By now you must know your father can never be turned from the dark side. And so it will be with you. Soon I'll be dead. And you with me. <laughs> I'm going to stop there.